G'day everybody and welcome to a Men of War final in the international tournament. Tournament We've got Strat29 going up against Greek393. I'm pretty sure it's not a final, but it's like the top 8 and blah 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 seeding rounds and things. I can't really remember because I haven't looked at the format for a little while. Shh, don't tell Strat that. But no, we'll be watching Strat today go up against, or tonight actually, go up against uh, Greek393. The best of friends are now the worst of enemies in this game. Yes, this is going to be a very, very interesting tie. It is USA of Strat29 versus the... Greek 393 German, so expect many, many 222s, and he's probably quivering in his boots. This is going up against such a highly regarded opponent, and I think he got a regular squad and got here first, so that is very, very interesting there. In Greek 393, sorry for that little static, I'm turned down there, it's just a little bit so I can hear my beautiful voice over the top of these machine guns, just firing, riddling shells into each other, really riddling bullets into each other, often a very, very nice rhythm, indeed, so there you go. I don't know why I'm actually the tracks, uh, Perspective, considering he's going to record it himself, and then he's going to upload it. Uh, he's going to upload on his his channel, AU Pro Gaming. And at the moment, I'm getting a little bit of a low frames per second, so I'm, I think I might be doing a lot of uh, just shots like this because for some reason, uh, the frames per second is shitting itself and gone very, very low at the moment. But there we go. The machine gunner goes down there, so very, very nice kill by uh, Strat 29. He has complete infantry dominance over the middle. Over the middle point, 85% just there. Greek 3 runs up with this grenade, beautifully thrown into there. He might not get the kill on that SMG soldier there. Oh no, he did. He got it close enough. Sorry, I thought it landed a little bit further away than that. But here comes the return grenade from Stratton. He might be able to get a double kill here. He dives out of the way, Greek, but unfortunately could not survive or could not get away with his life. He's also going to pick up the grenade off this SMG soldier. Beautiful micro display here by Stratton 9. Gets the kill on Greek 393 soldier and then starts capping the points. 1 to 0 right now in the favor of the USA Army, which is obviously Strat 29. He's got his machine gun all the way back up here now. This is if any uh, competitors are watching him in this uh, game right now. He really likes to attack this side of the middle when he's the USA. He really likes to get in through here and just try and be annoying. I 1v1'd on him. Uh, 1v1 him on this map not long ago. He's very, very annoying through that area, but the shotguns are probably going to be able to cut up the machine gun right there. No, the machine gun is picking him off with ease right now. There you go. The shotgun finally gets the kill. Very well played there. Greek will probably make some sort of uh, interjection of our shotgunners in the coming seconds. That shotgun goes down. Oh no, it was a rifleman, so maybe the shotgun is back here healing up or something. I'm sure he's around there somewhere. I can see the green dot. I can't hover over him at the moment, but Greek gun on 3 needs to recap his half of the middle flag right now because he's in a lot of trouble. Also strapped with an M3 AT gun. Yes, uh, he's very, very 2-2 friendly, uh, Greek gun on 3 but very interesting buy. Don't, I don't usually see strat going an M3 AT gun, so he's obviously changing his strategy uh, depending on the player. So very nice. He's also got shotgunners in there controlling the river. These shotgunners really control the river. Yes, you can have the sandbags, but if the shotgunners are at the bottom, it does not really matter. It's Greek is calling a shotgun hope. There it is. It's 3 to 0 right now. Two points to none at the moment. And Strat 29 moves forward with that M3 T gun. It'd be interesting where he places it. I'm actually expecting maybe a placement of around here ish because he owns this side of the map. And if he put it on this little plateau, he could definitely run the middle with that little M3AT gun, also stop himself from being flanked. Obviously, the right-hand point would be a little bit of a uh, problem, but it's not really Strat's main concern at the moment. I guess it's his main uh, avenue of attack at the moment. The 30 cal squad is up. I'm pretty sure he just bought. Yes, he did. But, um, no, it's, it's probably, it'd probably be a little bit better if he just consolidated on the left-hand side a little bit more with that M3AT gun, but I suppose he's put it... Uh, off the center of the middle, so I guess he can control the right-hand side, which he does not own. Also, the middle, which he does own, and that left-hand side does look a little bit open, but I'm sure the Greek will not go 2 to 2 charge in our means. A very, very good player, focusing on one point, as we can see right now. He's running this uh, right-hand side point, his left-hand side point at the moment, but he's running it, but unfortunately, I think he's going to fall into some trouble. 80 rifles and bazookas on this map are absolute gold. You cannot have enough bazookas and bushes and stuff like that. It's just literally everywhere, and the biggest way to counter them is flame throwers. Flame throwers on this map are gone. Also, 18 between 80 rounds are also gone as well. And that 30 cal gunner just finds one shell, uh, one shell, one uh, clip, uh, one clip, one bullet from his clip. Jesus, imagine if I didn't drive. No, one bullet from his clip and gets a headshot, I guess. On that soldier, the 50 cal is not going to be able to take out the 60, but 30 cal might not do any damage either. Hopefully, Rick can kill this 30 cal gunner. He's taking shots at it, but. Unfortunately, I think it's probably going to be able to get away. He's also taking shots at it there. I don't think these sandbags can be broken by 222 fire, so a bit of map, no, map hacks there. If you like to say that, this just 
does backflips. I'm sure that wasn't fire damage, but I guess it was. Now that he's uh, blowing up, the machine gun and shotgun troopers also running this center flag for Strat 29. There's the M3AT gun. Will it come into play and get the kill that it's so desperately needs to get as it was bought for it? Hell Pierce, he's got no one in that Greek 393. That 222 will be destroyed. Will be destroyed. <laughs> I was just stumbled over my words a little bit. So I didn't know he was going to destroy it. Not you. Self destruction initiated. Steve is being hull pierced. Unfortunately, can't get the hull destroyed. I kind of want to see a pretty explosion in the background a little bit. Hull damage. There you go. So you can't get in it without repairing it. It's also another assault squad in the back. There we go. It finally goes down. So very well played there. Yes, another assault squad back here from Grid Command 3. He's being beaten off every single point. Threatening a three cap right now. Strato 9 showing why he's probably the favorite to take out this tournament at the moment. He's definitely just being able to. Really just waltz up to this right hand point and take it. Greek says GG. I don't know if that's a forfeit or not, but hopefully he tells me before he forfeits. A little bit premature forfeitulation. I guess, yes, there's another premature ejaculation joke on this channel. There are many of them. They are funny. But uh, here comes the rifleman, I guess a regular squad maybe. Greek trying to try push up on this point. He's also got an 18 pitcher back there, but the shotgun is just have just done very, very well. I'm pretty sure he spammed out quite a few shotgun as well. Not spammed, I guess he's bought quite a few shotgunners. He does sit on the timer a little bit more than myself. He's bought another regular squad as well, but I suppose shotgunners, Mitch with regular squad are just really the way to go. So there you go, there's more shotgunners up along there, I think. No, that's regular squad. There's also a shotgunner back here who's obviously died. No, he's still in there. There's also another two moving along this side of the river. And yeah, the shotgunners once again have just proven how handy they are in a 1v1 situation and showing why USA is the best 1v1 nation. Just, just the shotgunners absolutely dominate. Just just carve up anybody's infantry if you can use them well. That's the problem. You've also got to use them well. You can't just buy a shotgun and expect that he's going to kill 45 million people. No, you need to use it very well. Well done there by uh, Shot 9. Knowing that his infantry is going to run into some trouble. Ducking them down. Throwing a grenade. Probably going to get a gun to out of it. Now he just gets one man. And then I think he dies himself. No, the rifleman's going to sit up there. Probably not going to be able to get the kills. And Brandenburg now coming out from that. Uh, he also needs many flamethrowers up on this point. A flamethrower uh, on this right hand point is also good. It's a bitch if you uh, don't mind my French. You know, get a flamethrower up into there and just easily flame on and destroy absolutely any infantry in this point. It's so. It, I cannot recommend the uh, the flamethrower higher. Uh, highly enough, really. I can just say I recommend it. No, I don't think I can go any higher, higher than that. I can say I highly recommend it. But then again, I don't think there's any higher recommendation. A high distinction. I give the uh, the flamethrower a high distinction on this map, which should be used more. And I'm disappointed that it wasn't used by Greek. It's 55 0. Apparently, he was the inventor of the flamethrower tactic. That's news to me. And I'm pretty sure that's news to pretty much everyone else. But uh, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't call it the flamethrower tactic. I just call it running with a flamethrower and burning people. Really, this this is. You just got to time it well. It's like a 2 2, two charge, which Greek does so well. All you've got to do is know when to charge that 2 2, two not when there's an M3 AT gun in the backfield, mind you. And is that a croc up? I was going to say, if that was the croc up, geez, that would have been funny. 40 seconds. It's pretty much true here. 69. 69 to 0. He's going to get some kills in this 2 2. He's going to go down to the Stuart. He's going to kill that Stuart. If he kills that Stuart, there will be a croc in 30 seconds that will chase his little 2 2 2 behind all the way to around the gates of Berlin. He's going to drive into it. Into a rock, so I guess that's always strategic. He's shooting another rock. He's backing out of there. Here comes the steward. Get that juicy kill. Very well played, straight 39. Pretty much sums up Greek 393's uh, game in one explosion. Shit. <laughs> I had, no other, I had no other adjective coming there. He's got an assault squad now, Strat, to recon, uh, reconciliate, reconciliate or consolidate on this... Oh, sorry, as I stretch my back over on this left hand point for him. Yes, we are facing this way. The left hand point for Strat 29. Greek has got a lot of infantry around here. I'm pretty sure there's Brandenburgers as well. You've got to duck down those Brandenburgers and get them into uh, bushes and use the shrubbery. The shrubbery of the nymph. Shrubbery, shrubbery, shrubbery. Use that for Brandenburgers. It's 89 0. There's, I'm running out of things to talk about as this 30 cal on the shoot is just tearing up Greek's infantry. Jeez, this has been really very, very. Uh, demoralizing display, I guess, for Greek time. So it's going to be interesting how he bounces back in the next game, which I will be casting. So get ready for it. He's got a half track as well, so I guess he's just going to be spamming out vehicles and just throwing the town a little bit. It's 92 to 0. At least he's still making flanking maneuvers, but the shotgunners are just destroying his face right now. The half track has got stuck in a rock tree formation like thing. And <laughs> he's stuck there a little bit. Jeez, there's a lot of explosions. The Greek 3 is actually capping 
or was capping back the middle, so very well played there. It's 94 to 0, not too long now. Just prolonging the game a little bit is Greek 293. Come on, tick up a little bit. Self destruct initiated. Greek says GG, 95 to 0. I'm like saying wrapping up the game, but it's going to take a little bit longer because there's only one point capped. It's nine, now we've got two points capped. It's 95 to 0, running out of words to speak. Uh, just speaking stuff. Beautiful half track explosion. Hood of Bonnet flips. 2-2-2 two, two, two in background, 97-0, come on game, and it's 2-2-2 two, two, two background, Stewart gets hull damage, middle nearly capped for strat, and now I can finally say GG, and I will catch you all next time.